greatest warrior that the Jewish people produced. He certainly was the first great warrior before King David. And um, the lands of Israel are defined by what he conquered. So whatever he, Joshua conquered in our land is considered holy and sanctified. Um, if another king came along and conquered the land, it would you know, not be as holy if he went out like different parts of Israel, which uh, like a lot is not considered as holy as, let's say, um, this part of Samaria or Judea that we were in today to, as well. So there are parts of Israel that Joshua conquered and those became extremely, they, they, they gathered a kedusha, a, a holiness, a sanctity that, that, that because of his greatness and his closeness to Moses, it, it, it produced all of what, all, he was the first to enter Israel. I mean, Moses never did. Joshua did. So um, just like Solomon built the temple, King David couldn't. Um, but even though King David set the way and set the pace, uh, it was up to Solomon to build the temple. So uh, we need that light, don't we? Um, so you're coming here, which is, I, I think, remarkable because I don't know how many congressmen you've ever brought here. I, I doubt you've brought too many, but uh, maybe you have. I, I don't know, but... I don't think you've ever brought anyone from Fox here before. Okay, okay, so that, that's the <laughs> distinction. Maybe you've brought some congressmen, but Pete understands this area, I think, very well now that you've explained it to him. I'm going to let Pete speak. No, I would just Thank say as, a, <clears throat> as someone who grew up on the stories of the Bible, uh, I know a great, grew up learning and hearing a, a great deal about Joshua and how central he was to the history of the Jewish people and the foundation of the Jewish state. And uh, to be here is to, is to pay homage to, as you mentioned, one of the greatest warriors we've ever seen on the planet, and certainly of the Jewish people in the state of Israel. Uh, and driving in here with the brave members of today's IDF uh, here with us right now is a reminder that it may keep, warriors are the only ones that will continue to maintain uh, what is here in the land of Israel. Uh, from warriors from Joshua to this gentleman right behind us uh, are the reason why the Jewish people live free and, will, and they will have to continue to be vigilant to do so and my prayer is that as Americans we will stand alongside shoulder to shoulder uh, to make sure that that happens so I am uh, absolutely honored to be here uh, it, is a, it is a highlight of my life and um, thank you all for making it happen thank you. Thank you.